Hi, my name is Max, and I'm the singer, guitarist, bassist, DJ, and drummer of Blind Boss. Blind Boss is a live multimedia experience. So the way Blind Boss came together as a one-man live show is I had been working with a, a lot of different bands over the past 10 or 15 years or so as I was learning how to play. After looking at like my backlog of songs and thought, why not give it a shot by myself? From a lyrical perspective, I um, often approach a lot of things with satire. My music will poke fun at a, a lot of different people. Each song goes through a different person, whether it's a different personality that I've kind of absorbed in my lifetime or uh, something that I just looked at objectively and then I'm painting a picture through my lens. I'll get a batch of songs ready and then head into a studio and record and edit that um, as far as like the sequence of songs and order and things like that. Uh, then my buddy Renzo and I will go into a like a video studio, white room with the infinity wall. Uh, we'll set up multiple different camera angles and he'll be holding like a, a nice DSLR or something. And we're just trying to get as many uh, energetic shots as possible. Uh, and then the real work all goes down um, at his office studio and we just sit there and it, it'll take a month to edit 45 minutes of material and that's working every night for about six hours, so. Welcome to Smith Room Studios. Come on in. This is where the magic happens. So a blind boss performance is gonna include a lot of random elements that I'm trying to bring to the table. It is pre-recorded, so it does present its set of challenges on how to make it more unique for someone seeing it for the first time versus someone seeing it for the eighth time. Heckling audience members as they're heckling me, uh, getting them to participate during choruses and songs. During tuning breaks, I might bring up current events or a stupid joke that I just thought of. Always trying to make it interesting for, for you and for me. This next song is about your pathetic addiction to your smartphone. Get over it. So after everything, all the recording, editing, and it's just about the live performance for me. Um, love being up in front of people and interacting with them, uh, talking with them after a show. And if someone comes up to me and says, I had a great time, thanks for playing, it makes my day. And that's why I'm gonna continue doing what I do.